Overseas, at least eight people were killed in the U.S. state of Texas after a driver plowed into a crowd of Venezuelan migrants near the border with Mexico. It is not known if the tragedy was purely an accident or intentional. Such in Katvi reports. The tragedy occurred at this bus stop at the border town of Brownsville, a landing hotspot for migrants from Central and South America. Eyewitnesses saw the driver of a Range Rover jump a red light before approaching the bus stop at high speed and mowing down people. It only came to a halt after the SUV rolled over. Most of the eight victims were Venezuelan men staying in a migrant shelter across the road. They were waiting for a bus to go downtown. There were no passengers in the car and the injured driver was taken to hospital. He was not identified and was believed to be in his 30s or 40s. As far as we didn't know, they're saying that the car lost control. Now, whether we know whether it was an accident or intentional, that is still under investigation. The driver was detained by officers, and he's getting medical care right now as we speak. And yeah, right now, he's facing at least a charge of reckless driving. But more than likely, there's going to be other charges coming on later on in the day. The easing of pandemic measures in recent months has led to an influx of illegal immigrants. But things are said to get a lot worse. A law enacted in early 2020 to expel migrants on COVID grounds is set to end this Thursday when the pandemic is no longer considered a public health emergency. Tens of thousands of migrants are expected to enter the country in the coming days, prompting the Biden administration to send 1,500 troops to the border to maintain peace and order. Sachin Katvi, HKIBC.